Good morning, Fall City Middle School. It is Monday, the 1st of November, and the countdown is on to Thanksgiving. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. All right, everybody, happy Monday, and today for lunch we are having... Popcorn chicken, mashed potatoes, corn, applesauce, a hot roll, not a cold roll, a hot roll, and milk. And happy legitimate real birthday. We've got two real birthdays today. Zane Elms and Aiden Scott. You sixth graders have a wonderful birthday and enjoy your popcorn chicken on us from the school. Great job, guys. All right, my AOK -okay is coming from an anonymous person going out to Mr. Kraft from an anonymous student. They say, Mr. Kraft, this A-OK -okay is for you for being the only gym teacher and best gym teacher we have. I don't know, Mr. Kraft. I, sounds like kind of an interesting A-OK. -okay. You are the only one, so I guess you're by default the best. So here's to you, Mr. Kraft. If you were a Chiefs fan, they would just say you're the best of all time. But Ravens fan, I guess you're it. That's all we got. So good job, Mr. Kraft. All right. Uh, let's see. Words of wisdom for today are about confidence. Our dreams for the future are very important. Think about it. Without a dream, would Thomas Edison have ever invented the light bulb? Would Henry Ford have ever mass-produced the automobile? Would astronauts have ever walked on the moon? Vasco da Gama was a 15th century ship's captain with a vision. From the time he was a young boy, he dreamed of sailing from his home in Portugal around the tip of Africa to India. It had never been done before. He worked hard to become a great sailor, and his dream eventually became a reality. Now listen to these words from Henry David Thoreau. If one moves confidently in the direction of his dreams and tries to live the life which he has imagined, he will meet with unexpected success. So today, ask yourself this. What are my dreams for the future? Am I moving confidently in the direction of my dreams? Remember, be a confident dreamer like Vasco da Gama, and your dreams may become reality. With something to think about, it's Mr. Banger. Make it a great day or not, the choice is always yours. And now, I have two special guests from the National Junior Honor Society. One of them is super excited because he is the mortician's son, and yesterday was Halloween, so it is National Mortician Day. All right. And the other one is our lo local apicultura. Oh, I just spit all over myself. Apiculture expert. Do you know what that means? All right, that's good. Matthew Eaton, if you don't know what that means, kids, look it up. Matthew Eaton and Emmett Dakey, otherwise known as Dakey. I'm going to fix this. You guys go to town there, mortician and apiculture guy. Did you know helping others helps improve your mind, mood, and attitude? NJHS wants to help Richardson County families who struggle with um, food insecurity by donating items in Southwest Nebraska. Community Actions, and Richardson County Humane Society, bring your daily themed items in your homeroom to teachers starting uh, November 4th, for example. Thursday, November 4th, the theme is Taste of Italy. Bring some items such as noodles, sauce, ravioli, etc. For various amounts collected as school students will be extra rewarded on November 18th. For collecting 250 items, Mr. Hubbard will kiss a guinea pig. For collecting 500 items, Mrs. Finley will kiss a ferret. And for collecting 750 items, Mr. Kraft will kiss a parakeet. For collecting 1,000 items, Miss Jeffries will kiss a goat. For collecting 1,500 items, Mr. Banger will kiss a bull snake. So collect your items and let's get a happy so that we teachers can guess animals. Is that it? Yep. yep. Just so you all know, I hate snakes. But I would rather kiss a snake than wear a Denver Broncos jersey all day. So thank you, NJHS, for making my punishment easier than it should be. So thank you to our local mortician and our local apic apiculture expert. I will see you all tomorrow. Have a great day, everybody.